how to hit that sneaky inverted knee bar here from the half guard position. It's a little trickier than when you're on top, but uh, as you can see, we're just in the same position, but reversed. So of course, it makes sense that you would be able to hit the same technique. Uh, always, you don't want your hands and your head completely tied up. Ugh. Or if he's opposite side, Ugh. you're right. So I have to deal with this first, always. I gotta find a way to clear him off of me and start working under my opponent's uh, grips here, under his arms, into his armpits, because I need to get him just slightly ahead of me. And it can be just as simple as that. Once you've got him here, both thumbs in the armpit, maybe even a little bump to this point. Now, once I'm here, I'm going to attack by grabbing and locking his waist. So I'm staying in relatively the same position on his leg, which is key to getting the right angle on the knee position to apply the lock. So I've shoved him forward. My heels are going to capture his foot here. I will lock his waist and body. So I'm keeping him in position. Now I'm going right to pull those heels. It's right there. Yeah. Long into the lever. I could use one foot, even as you might see here, and then lock on top. Or like I was doing, I was scooping with this heel before. Ooh, ooh. Oh, sorry. Then using my foot on top to push. And then I'm getting that inverted knee bar. Take a look again. So I have to make sure that I can get my hands free of this grip here. I want to be able to get under Chris's armpits and start moving him slightly uh, slightly above me, or at least I should say above me enough that now I can get the proper angle on the knee and on the long part of the lever. So I'm here, I gotta work to get this head up, sorry, up and out, get to his armpit, ugh, start scooting him right here, lock in. Now, it's not an exact science, but you're gonna pummel with your feet. You're basically just pummeling with your feet here. Huh? I have it. Simple as that. My hips thrust through the knee joint while I'm pulling at the long end of the lever. And I think a lot of times what you're gonna find is you're gonna be off to one hip and kind of at an angle here. But you could potentially be right here, in fact, get them straight up on top of you. That's your inverted knee bar from under the half